That is a hint of how we get this book down. Ram headlong into it. Ram headlong into it. Ram headlong into it. God damn it. Okay, how do we get this book down? Oh, shit. Oh, no. That is a hint of... God damn it. That is a hint of how to become a minish to get in there. Ram headlong into that. Okay. Oh, I need my gust jar. Boop, boop, boop. Okay, no enemies. I don't want to fall off my lily pad. That would suck. Can't wait to get another heart container because I'm going to have an extra row and it will look a lot more manly. Don't bounce away, yeah. Yeah. I'm not sure which way to push this thing. Yeah. Hoo, hoo. Yeah. Okay. That's the book down. Did we have to become a minish? Yeah, we had to become a minish to get every single book. So that's like a little minish adventure for you. Alright. Let's go get this book. Take it back to the library. And then... Ooh, that should... Uh, now there's enemies here. I knew there'd be enemies at some point. God damn it. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Why all the way up there? Da -da -da -da. A history of masks. Okay, let's take this back to... The library. Ah. Down here. Down here. Oh, my God. There we go. Okay, I want to see what's up these stairs. I think it's the Syrup's Hut. Yeah, it is. Let's see if she has that red potion in before I go back to Hyrule. Yes, she does. Do I have any? Yes, I do. I will buy some if I have enough money for it. One hundred and fifty rupees. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, red potion. Drink it and replenish your life energy. All right. I'm not going to be drinking that anytime soon. Alright then, I just remembered we can teleport straight back to the uh, Hyrule Town. So let's go! Yay! Do I have a swing press? Yes I will. Ooh, something else I want to do first. And then I'll take the book back next time. Uh, do you remember... Oh, there's another thing. <laughs> I keep finding things to do. For one thing we have to do this that we unlocked with David Jr. Weirdest Tingle name ever. And I forgot to do the Tingle guy at Lon Lon Ranch, which sucks. And yay, Mysterious Shells. So I'll go back and do him as well. Oh my god, there are so many things to do right now. I don't think we'll ever get to the next temple. We'll just be doing side quests forever. Ow. Alright, so there were some things in the Hyrule Castle Gardens that we unlocked with Kinstones. Both of them were these staircases. So let's see what's down them. A little piece of heart. Awesome. Clicking four to make a new heart container. Okay, so I think that was the first of four, so three more to make another uh, heart container. And we can't, can we? No, you need to be a minute to get through there, so... And that is where the next thing I want to do is, so let's go through here. Uh, and I still need to get some more abilities from the... I need to get more scrolls, I've only got two, which is like a pathetic amount right now should have like at least five or something ridiculously high. I know I should have at least one more because there's a ability we do use with the Pegasus boots that I should have gotten by now. Okay, this is how you get through the gardens by the way. Um, not that way. Uh, up here. I hope there's something to turn back into a human. For oh come on! There's a thing right there. How did I miss that? Uh, I think there's actually a, a soul trainer in that bush thing. Is there a thing to turn back into a human here? If there isn't, I just completely wasted my time. How the hell do you turn back into a human? Seriously. Seriously, how do I do it? That's just annoying. What would being a munition here solve? 
I suppose I've got to wait for him to move first. That's uh Okay, I thought he has become a minish. Never mind completely wasting time, which is time we do not have because I need I've got lots of things to be doing. Uh there we go. Ooh. Okay. Uh Yeah, to the Lon Lon Ranch, I'll do this next Tingle guy. The closest one to the Lon Lon Ranch would be that one. Alright. Wee. That's a wee. Yeah, okay, Lon Lon Ranch. Alright. Ow. Every time. Every time. Alright, up here. This should be... Alright, uh, up here. Yep, thought so. Charging Doom! Alright, should be up here. Uh. Yep. Let's go. Oh. I can guarantee I can pretty much do all these now, because I think I have one of every kinstone that you do with random people. His name is Ankle. Alright, now I've just got Tingle to do, and Tingle is south and then west, I think. So, let's go do Tingle, and then I'll go and get those two, and then I'll get that item that you get in there, and then I'll end this part. Thank you. Hello. Ah. Oh. Alright. Thank god the time limit was extended to 15 minutes, that makes this so much easier. Okay, Tingle should be through somewhere. I'm pretty sure it's south and west. Should be. Let's go south. Ow. South. And then west. Alright, it should be in here. Yep. I know this world map way too well to know exactly where people are. Mister. Alright. Boom. Want to use kingstones? I'd be happy to. There you go. I only had one of those. That was quite lucky. Alright then. Tingle. Quite ironic that we did Tingle last given that he's the first one we tried to do. Ding. Alright then. That's that side quest almost finished. I have 50 arrows now. I just realised that I bought that large quiver and have more arrows to carry. It's very good. Uh, uh, ah, God damn it, I hate it when people get in your way. I already said that, but it's true. It's so annoying, because they, ah, they stop you and then you have to like... Whenever you use the Pegasus boots, you stand still for like a second or two before you start running. So, it is irritating when you have to stop. It's also irritating that the ladder is on the opposite side to the way you come in. So you have to... Walk around. Shells. Kinstone. Oh, I'll take that. One more. Alright. Yep, there it is. The ladder. It's awesome. Kinstone, please. Alright. Uh, yeah, through here. Are you ready, guys? Ready? Ready. Do you know what the item is, huh? Do you want to know? There it is. Magical boomerang. Sounds lame. Totally isn't. <laughs> I'll show you outside. Basically, this boomerang goes a lot further than pretty much the entire screen over. And, for example, if I hold down while I'm throwing it, it will go down. And if I hold up, oh, if I hold up, it goes up. So basically, you can control the direction that it goes in and throw it around a corner, so I can throw it up there from here. Which is why this item is very helpful, and I do recommend getting it, because it's, it's not very hard to get, and it is a lot better than the boomerang that you paid a lot of money for. I think it was 300 rupees for the other one. 
So that's another item gone. Uh, we only have t now we only have two more items. Ah, three items actually. We upgrade an item and we get two more. I'm pretty sure that's everything then. We can also upgrade the amount of bombs we have, which I haven't done yet. Ooh, that's not bad. I've got lots of things to do. Okay, so I think I'll end that here. Uh, this time on The Legend of Zelda, we got the Magical Boomerang, which is a very good item that I recommend getting. And we uh, did lots of side quests, I think. We got the book, the third book, and next time we'll be taking it back and speaking to Elder Library. Library or Library, whatever his name is. And then we'll be doing some more side quests. Yay. Uh, see you guys then. Thanks for watching.